Hi, and welcome back to another football shirt review. Today, we are looking at the Arsenal away shirt from the 22-23 season. The shirt was purchased from FC24 store and took 10 days to arrive from being dispatched. Details of the seller can be found in the description of this video. If you are new around here, please hit that subscribe button as I do reviews like this on a weekly basis. Also leave any questions, comments, messages below, I'll always respond, whether it's around this shirt, the seller or any of us, happy to give you the information that I have. As you can see, this shirt comes in a standard Adidas bag, as we flip it over, we have our usual health warnings on the back. Now this is the player version, and say it's from FC24 store. So really looking forward to seeing this one. We have done a fans version before, so it'd be good to see what the player one is like. So what we'll do is we'll get the bag open and let's have a look at the Arsenal away shirt from the 22-23 season. So we'll start around the collar line. And that looks spot on. Being the player version, the Adidas stripes have been pressed on. They look really good actually. They're really smooth. Likewise, this side feels equally as smooth as well. You wouldn't actually even know they're there. The Adidas manufacturer, heat pressed on. It's raised from the material, but it feels really nice actually. It looks really clear. I do prefer the player ones, because I think, because they're um, pressed on, it just looks a lot better. But I've noticed, I'm try and zoom in have it a little bit clearer, that there is some, something beyond the S, not sure what that is. The Arsenal badge again, heat pressed on. Nice and secure. Shirt sponsor. That's amazing. That feels like the Adidas. You can't even feel it's there. That's madness. Really impressed with that. Bottom of the shirt, we have our authentic licensed product for the 22-23 with the Adidas emblem. And on this side, being the player one, we do have the heat ready. Shirt's sure, got a slight lip at the bottom, which I always think looks nice. Makes the hemline look so much better. And on this sleeve, we do have the sleeve sponsor, which is the Visit Rwanda, which if I can just try and stretch it out a little bit. The crease there is from where it's been in the bag, but that feels nice as well. Really smooth. So we'll just zoom out and give you the full overview of the shirt before we flip it around and have a look at the back. Do like that print still in it. Okay, we're now at the back, collar line looks good as well. I remember someone telling me that this um, this join should be on the side, I just think it looks a bit weird, but that's how it's meant to be. Not a lot to really call out on the back, stitching looks absolutely perfect. I haven't got any names or numbers on this, but we'll come further out and you can get the full overview. So not a lot really to look at on this one. It's always nice when you have the name and number, but when you've got the pattern in the shirt like this one, I think it actually looks better without a name and number. There you go. We'll flip it on the inside and let's have a look. These FC24 store shirts tend to be really good on the inside. Okay, we're now on the inside and yeah, straight away, look at that, absolutely perfect. Not a single additional bit of thread or cotton or anything. And as we move down the arm, likewise, not a single problem. I don't know where this company get the shirts from, but honestly, they are fantastic. Usually we see something, but cannot fault this at all. Got the Arsenal crest there. It's really smooth, no creasing in the shirt, likewise with the Adidas. I didn't expect there to be anything wrong with the Adidas one, um, but it's always good to check. And where the sponsor's been put on as well, no creases in the material. Absolutely fantastic the way it's been put on. Moving down, we do have our washing instructions. Remember with these sort of shirts, hand wash only, and also flip the shirt inside and out. I've had some people ask me how long these sort of shirts last for, and if you wash them, I'm still wearing some from, well, six months ago, if not longer. 
and I wear them on a regular basis when I play football. So if you look after the shirts, they will last. Okay, on the final part of the inside, I do like that little grey band. And there we have our product code and the QR code. Don't imagine it'll bring up Arsenal, but if anybody wants to check, leave a message in the comments and let me know where it takes you to. We have our sizing, this says XL, likewise on the tag it says XL, but these shirts always recommend sizing up, so this is probably going to be more like a large. Got the Arsenal badge, yeah, that's really smart actually. That's like a hologram sort of image. Got the standard Arsenal tags, got something else that tries to see what that green one is. Made out of recycled polyester. So all the good tags, just jumping over to look where the Adidas stripes are. No single problem at all with those. Been put on really well. Not a lot to look at on this side of it, but that gives you a full overview. Not a single piece of loose threading on this one. Just jump down to the hemline quickly. Look at that. Absolutely perfect. Fantastic. So there it is, the Arsenal away shirt from the 22-23 season really really good one i do like the player ones i think that's because like i said these are all printed in or not printed on but heat pressed on instead of being stitched or embroidered i think it just looks so much better this shirt is honestly one of the best ones i've seen um i know i've said that before around some of these um fc24 store ones but this one is phenomenal cannot pick any holes in it i also i can't i like picking a hole and i suppose that's the only one I'm just not sure well, that is between the S, but in all honesty, if that's what I'm doing, that really is nitpicking. So, top, top delivery. All details for the seller can be found in the description. So if you are new around here, hit that subscribe button. I do these reviews on a weekly basis. Leave any comments, questions, messages below. I will always respond to you, whether that's around this shirt, the seller, or any shirts you want to see in the future. Always interested what to what to buy, I want to know what you want me to buy and then I'll review. So thank you very much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.